Hey everybody, welcome back to White One Ammo Garage. Today I'm working on my 94 3500 HD and they made these between 91 and 2001. They are the true HD. The uh, one ton series GMT, I think it stands for General Motors truck, is 400 and this is a, considered a 455. They were made um, during those years and were replaced by the, the, the C4500, the larger truck. These were built as an interim uh, so that they could do more work or heavy, heavier loads and that kind of thing. But that's not what the video is about. I actually have some information I want to share about these trucks for those who own them. There's uh, quite a few of them out there and only a couple of videos. So I hope to uh, do a series on this. But today we're working on this bracket that is no longer available from GM. At least the right side, passenger side. My parts guy said they're no longer available. If you can find them, they're $138.50 a piece, at least in my local dealership and it is the one of many differences that you have to look out for when working on these trucks. Cabs are regular cabs from 1500, 2500, 3500. They did that as a cost saving measure and it also makes it easier for you and I to order parts. So if anytime you're going to order interior parts or doors or mirrors it's just regular 3500 or 1500 truck. So they put that cab on a heavier duty frame and they had to make some changes to you know make that happen. So one of them was these supports for your bumper are not the same as your 3500. Like I was saying these are not available uh, at least the right side, uh, sorry, yeah the right side, the passenger side was not so uh, luckily I found these on Marketplace uh, here in Tennessee but he shipped them to me for 154 the pair so I thought that was a pretty good deal and uh, we're just going to put them on today. One of the things I wanted to tell you about anytime you're doing work on the front end I found out uh, bumper is a uh, working on the bumper I should say, is you have to start from the top, go down. You gotta take the grill out, you gotta take the uh, the center section out or the uh, filler plate I guess they call it, which by the way is a, yeah, a good way to identify the HDs. They have these filler plates between the bumper and the grill. I'll show that to you in a better picture. So where was I? Uh, yeah, so this is one difference. You won't find these on the 3500. You got to get the 3500 HD and good luck finding them. So it's just easy four bolts uh, once you get to it because I was trying to get underneath first. It's not going to work. The grill and all this has to come off first. Just a shot of this uh, corrosion protection fluid film and will uh, extend the life of those fasteners. Obviously the hood's still up on this truck, but you now may recognize these HDs that has a filler plate between the grill and the bumper. Appreciate you all hanging around. We'll see you in the next video.